Wow, there is a beautiful, powerful energy appearing in your presence today. It's as if it is coming through you itself. This chariot energy is protruding through your your aura. Yeah? But it's more than that. It's more than just you. So listen, you are putting this energy through this champion chariot vibration. Here, all of your abundance moving forward is because you are in strength position here. You are exuding confidence. You know who you are. I keep telling you that. You are radiating, you're glowing, you're powering up, you know, you're dominating your own field A strong man masters others, a wise man masters himself. So you're very wise here in how you're looking to master your own emotions, your own energy, creating the life that you desire, you dream of, and it's coming into full manifestation. And you're not just, um, because the strength and the magician is very similar energy, it's masculine, feminine, you know. The masculine is more out, like you're working with the magic of the external elements. The feminine is subtle, you know, more divine. How you breathe, how you transmute internally, how you work with your hormones, for example. All of that is helping you to manifest the life of your dreams. It's helping you to change your beliefs, how you think about yourself, how you value yourself and the things you want to come into your life. So not because my voice is so easy, like these cards are amazing for your money vibration. So there's a lot of work going on. It's as if you're working quietly, like undercover. Yeah? Yeah. The king of wands, the highest you can come into your energy today is yeah, bringing in your energy. All of it. It feels like all of your energy you see it's almost like cultivating your energy it's like you're going to be manifesting something huge it's like bringing in energy you've been storing up what was i talking about energy yesterday when it comes to kung fu right cultivating your energy and then using it to, to um in one area you want to really manifest in so that could be your work what your money coming forward to you this can be sexual energy or anger because this is really about like manifestation, transmuting of energies. It's almost like you feel it's going to get deep. I feel like I've done this before in a dream or something. But it's almost like you want something bad enough. The entire universe is working with you, the magician and the strengths, right? We see that the external and the internal universe working, collaborating with you as you work to bring this manifestation into being. All of this amazingness with the chariot vibration here. But to make this, to get this energy, it's like we talk about Kamehameha and powering up because after the eight of pentacles is the nine of pentacles, which is that Kamehameha vibration powering up. It's mastering of the mana the source energy so if you have a lot of sexual energy because you know if you do um you're into stuff like that you know about saving your sexual energy and using it to manifest i don't know i feel like you could be talking about that as well i don't know much about it so you could go um read about tantric um sex and some meditation and stuff like that because i really do feel like this is taking me to egypt I swear, when the gods would want to manifest and they they use their energy, I'm not sure how it goes, but it's if I knew the information, I feel like I could tell it to you better. But as I'm seeing in the cards, I'm feeling like people like know how, knowing how to use their own energies to so do some research with the chariot energy as well. That's also studying, being a you know, getting your information, do your own due diligence, study, being. That's that's what I'm talking about. If I knew the information, I would know what to do. So I feel like if you should study, because um, the chariot energy really feels like someone who is bright who is a scholar who knows all the magic you know he just came back from magic school you know what i mean he knows the tricks and the trades and he's been working with his own energy so go look at uh sex magic it's not and it's not negative it's about your own energy in your body so if you're not exerting all of your energy 
in in toxic sexual habits and you you've been saving your sexual and it's an energy that can i feel bring around to you some things that you you dream of because remember even visualizing all of that is energy as well it's it's creating a picture everything is energy so something like that i feel like this reading is supposed to be so very powerful in teaching you how to manifest sharing your gifts as well you know i feel like after you this is what is the result if you try this trick today you're going to see you're going to receive i don't know what the trick is i feel if whatever you look up on the internet and practice it with the magician energy i feel like you can put something into practicality today when it comes to your energy i don't see the kind of breathing honestly in this manifestation message it's talking about energies of the king of wands that's sex that's passion desires that's creativity that's visualization that's manifestation you know arts even in your heart your emotions those energies we're talking about i feel like if you try to do that you're gonna squeeze a little like, this is telling me something like this is telling me about a juice this is the juice that you're gonna come get it's not going to be a lot i swear that's how i feel it's like this is the first time you're going to attempt this but you do you are going to see results manifested like either you're going to look around in a purse and you see a few silver dollars and you're like wow you're going to know that this is what caused that to happen as this is how i'm feeling you know about this energy so i don't know i don't know what i feel like whatever if you go on youtube whatever it is you type up to look for this kind of manifestation you're going to find something you're gonna click on it you're gonna try it you're gonna keep it in your energy with the strength card as well as you're practicing it with magician and you're also holding it in some way shape or form inside like beliefs um we don't know how you hold on to the feeling inside also is the magic as well but then you're going to see some you're going to see the evidence of it showing up knight of swords hmm judgment day on the front line front line you're on the front line now um i feel like you have dreams you have inherited something you're chasing something or you're running from or someone is running towards you something is happening now as we speak it could be the wind that's blowing it could be information that's coming into you that's charging like it's a lot of information this is how it feels you know because remember the sword is the word as well it could be aggressive it could be so, like um just it's like a, a, a force of information that's coming into you or taking action or a change of mind or something you're going to hurry and do to see if it works. It could be this that practicing this new thing that you've just come up on, new information with the Ace of Wands, something about your dreams or taking action towards a dream or having new dreams. Oh my God. I like that that is the ace of cups i like that this is involved in this reading i'm so grateful because honestly i feel like i was going on some t going into territories that I, that I don't i'm not familiar with you know but i feel like with the ace of cups it's all good it's all good um it's a, a love um an abundance of love that you're going to be receiving could be new love look at this we have two aces here beautiful i like that you're going to be receiving some new gift or information or feeling intuition like we talk about the penis we're talking about love here we're talking about sexual desires we're talking about manifestation and new feelings coming through you see that be careful you know just be careful i don't know I don't know. I don't know. And breathe. So I'm um, happy to see the card of breathing here as well. Breath to work. Uh, it's going to help you to make better decisions. Also to clear out your mind. Um, to do what you feel is right for you when it comes to the, your dreams. And going after what you desire. All right. So I'm leaving these messages here for you. I hope you found some that inspire you and is able to help you on your journey. Much love to you. Take care. This is Sage. Such a healing tarot. Okay. 
and if you like the video if you like the video hit the thumbs up share it with those you love and do subscribe come back again for whenever i upload new content for you much love remember that you're all and all is within you take care bye